Namaskar, good evening, Dr. Guman and all of your friends. Welcome to Biotech Ayur, Odisha, India. I must thank you for visiting my R&D and taking care of the science of Ayurveda of India. I am an author of several books in Ayurvedic medicine, plants, fruits, vegetables, and I am a researcher, world traveler. I have been living in the US for the past 37 years. What I intend to do in India, I am doing work on various phytochemicals, uh, isolated molecules we, on medicinal plants of India. 70 years back, India got independence. Until now, India did not discover a single drug. What you see in modern medicine, risorpine, morphine, disdalis, dopamine, and many drugs, lymphocysteine, many, many things have derived from Ayurvedic medicine of India. In the future, I have a unique project to work on. I need your assistance cooperations of Ayurvedic doctors and scientists who are doing research on phytochemicals. Fruits and vegetables are very important. Fruits and vegetables and um, leaves, colored leaves, contains cyanine, proanthocyanine, contains phytochemicals, contains chromo phytochromo materials which are anti-cancer. So what I intend to do, I need to isolate those materials. Fruits like berries contain high percent of antioxidant. Berries are like blackberry, blueberry, strawberry, and other fruits like plum, you know, contain fruits which are very colorful. Beets, carrots, are onion, you know, red onion. Those are very colorful too. Those contain tons of cyanine carotenoid. We need to isolate those molecules. We need to standardize those molecules and put into our daily food, like salt and pepper. What I intend to do, those things must be standardized. Same thing, the science of Ayurveda based on bio, Pitta and Kapha, those things must be standardized. So, Nadi Vigyan, what we are talking today, could be computerized and the diagnosis can be done on computer softwares. Those things must be done. Many things could be done. Myself and Dr. Guman would understand the science of Ayurveda as we are living in a Western country like America. America is hungry for those things, like yoga. Ayurveda is becoming very popular and in, not only in America, in Europe. But what I see in India, Ayurveda is old and I don't see any research work, only they are talking. Materials are not standardized, materials are not validated properly. So we need equipment like chromatographic equipment, you know, like ICPMS to detect heavy metals in Ayurvedic medicine and food products, food supplements. Same thing, we need to see the standardized materials on HPLC or GCMS to validate those materials properly for consumer goods, consumer products. Thank you. I thank you very much and thank you to my all of my staff here and I'm happy that you are here. Enjoy Biotech Ayur. Tomorrow morning we will take you to our manufacturing facility. God bless you.